Hi, I'm Tony Patelaresco, and this is another segment here uh, being filmed by Dave Chris Chrissa at Grassroots Production. Okay, keep that name in mind. One day it's going to be big in lights. But anyway, today we're going to show you how to make a toothpaste or a tooth cleaning. Very inexpensive, very powerful. For some of you, when you do this, when you brush your teeth, you're going to feel like you've actually got out of a dentist chair. That's how clean it is. And it's not going to break the bank. Matter of fact, if you do it this way, your money on toothpaste could actually be really, really stretched. What you're going to need is grapefruit seed extract. Okay, I got a little tape on mine because I've got super, super strength in this one. But you can use regular strength. Any one like this, GSE, this has got some multi purpose functions. But just use the normal one. You're only going to use one drop with this, okay? Just so you know. So, you got baking soda. Some of you are going to say, well, get the baking soda that you can afford or what you can do. This is for the common Joe who cannot afford some of the stuff at a health food store. Those of you who can, can buy the more expensive stuff. By all means, spend, spend your money. Uh, anyway, what you're going to do, this is your baking soda, your GSE. This is your toothbrush. What you're going to do is you're going to wet the toothbrush a little bit, okay? Dip it in, about so. Take one drop, like so, and then proceed to brush your teeth. Once you get done, it'll lather up. Now, and let me caution you, if you put too much on here, it will burn the gum. It'll sting it a little bit, like, it'll give it like a little blister. But this is very penetrating. You're also going to find that when you do this this way, your teeth are actually going to be whiter. A lot of tar and build up of tar is going to go. This also can be used to clean your dentures. If you're wearing dentures or plates, you can use this. But what you can do with this is you would put your one drop of, um, one or two drops of GSC in the water. You would put your baking soda in the water and then uh, you would put, uh, citric acid in. We'll do a demonstration on this just so you have an idea. We were just talking about making a toothpaste and so now we're going to show you how something else. Same ingredients, GSE, okay one drop, that's it, in your water, swirling around. We're going to make a denture cleaner, okay? You can either add your baking soda or your citric acid. So you put your citric acid in, We'll put a lot in. That's probably more than that, about a half a teaspoon. Put it in there. Okay. It'll break down in the water, give it a bit of a swirl. All right, then take your baking soda. Again, you're not going to need a lot. So just put it in. And as you can see, she's foaming up. Give it a bit of a swirl. You would have your dentures or your plates in there. It will sanitize them. It will clean them. If you have any sugar or yeast or any thrush in the mouth as a result of the plate, this stuff will kill it. This stuff will neutralize it. This is one of the reasons why you take GSC wherever you go. Because it's, this is how easy this is. Okay? You can... Other things, if you want to clean, you can put it in there or sanitize. You just made your own little... Um, denture cleaner. And if you let them sit in there, sometimes you can see stuff coming out that you think, where did the heck that come from? And some of them that have been stained for a long period of time, you may find this will remove this heavy stains and grid stains. Even when you brush your teeth, you'll be surprised somebody who smoked tobacco or, or if had eaten cinnamon or some other spice that may have darkened the teeth, this may clean them. You may see a brightening effect. It may not be right away, but you may see a big difference. You may find all of a sudden that the gum line is feeling a lot freer and healthier because of the way it sanitizes the mouth. This is something very simple. It didn't cost you an arm and leg. This is probably going to be the most expensive item you're going to buy. It might cost you $16, $18 for this or $10 depending on where you are. This will last you for years, for years. 
So you may put out that initial outlay, but when you figure out how much you're spending for a tube of toothpaste that's got fluoride and other harmful chemicals, this is a lot better alternative. You can use this in multifaceted in all kinds of ways. You can take this and drink this. One or two drops and two ounces of water. Everything I put in here, I can just I can drink. It would be perfectly safe. Baking soda with the citric acid and the GSC, these are antioxidants. This is an alkalizer. Uh, this works with muscle tissue. You can drink this and it won't hurt you. Okay, that's how safe that is. So let's say a kid or a, kid or a pet you know, started drinking this. It may make a pet maybe a little nauseous, but it won't hurt them. It won't hurt you either at all. All right? Just so you know, this is how you can do things. And until the next segment, to your health. And remember, Agenda 21 is coming.